Hey guys, this is Richard from Wildsea Tech and this is my next video for you. This is the Assassin X90 SE from Thermorite. It's a new air cooler on the market from Thermorite. It's LGA 1700 and it is a 90mm fan which you can probably see it below. there. It is very small. It's probably the smallest I've seen of them. I've got benchmarks as well as my overall opinions. Now for the box this is the box the content you get it's basic uh normal cut at the bottom there's no aluminium plate it's just basic with the copper pipes is actually showing the heat pipes are actually showing so it's just faced off this is a new product off them and it's 2500 rpm the fan it's obviously 27.3 decibels and it's a sf db bearing uh, obviously this is a very small air cooler it's got six heat pipes and that's about it so let's get into the benchmarks and as for the benchmarks I have done primarily all CPU type benchmarks as you're probably going to imagine as this is mainly an air cooler so as for benchmarks itself I did Cinebench R20 R23, they, they were all custom runs, the 3D Mark CPU test, then I put in Blender Classroom and Blender BMW because they do tend to hit the CPU a bit harder. So, for Cinebench R20, the idles were 29, the max hit the 66 Celsius, that was for a 10 minute custom run. Cinebench R23, idles were 33 Celsius, the max was 66 again. That was also a custom run. 3D Mark CPU test, the idle was 33 Celsius. The max was 55. For some reason, that doesn't hit the CPU like it used to. Uh, Blender Classroom, the, the idles were 32 Celsius. The max it hit was a 64. And Blender BMW was idle at 34 Celsius. The max was a 63. So overall, they were all custom runs, except for uh, CPU, CPU um, test, obviously. Blender was run just a basic blender render exactly the way it comes when you download it so overall my opinions obviously it hasn't got rgb that's one thing i don't like but oh well uh it is a very nice looking air cooler as you can see it's very small and overall the design and the aesthetics is quite nice as i said it's got heat uh six heat pipes but obviously they're stacked in fours like this stacked up like that it, it you know it's very nice it it's for a 90 millimeter fan you could probably well i mean here we go, see if you can actually hear that. That's the fan at full tilt. So I don't know if you can actually hear that, but... Well, actually, I can give you a reference. This is what the actual... Be these uh, these fans by here sound like. That's full tilt, okay? Now, this is that fan. It's actually quite very, very, very quiet for a small fa uh, air cooler. Obviously, they use the um, the same type of mounting that Noctua uses, and I'm all for that because it's probably the easiest mounting to use. Overall, it's all black. The fan's black. Yeah, it may not look the best aesthetically, but it does the job well something a small basically it, it's mainly meant for smaller type cases obviously this is the dark base 700 it's quite a big large it's a lot quite a big mid tower and it's not meant for something this big it's meant for more of a compact case so basically something like a, a, a matx or i itx type case it would be all right obviously you're gonna have to be careful with the height of course um but overall i mean it's a very nice air cooler obviously the height on it is 118 millimeters so you know it's, you're gonna be kind of limited in certain cases but overall very nice you know I, I wish that i wish there was a bit of rgb there but that's just me personally i like my rgb but overall very nice very nice and that's pretty much it guys now this will be the uh, last video i do before christmas ends uh before the new year uh, there will be more. I've got another air cooler from Thermalright to do. And overall, that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you subscribe because I've got more stuff coming in 2023. I'm hoping to make sure I bring all the content you guys want. So, 
overall make sure you subscribe make sure you like and also make sure to comment i want to know what you guys want to see i don't want to just do reviews because honestly it gets boring so i want to do different projects now like the the budget gaming pc i did uh yes that went live saturday that i really enjoy building that and doing testing so if you want to see that type of stuff please make sure you comment down below and let me know this is rich from Welsh Tech. goodbye